is going to be a winter 2021 FabFitFun unboxing. So I have officially had this box for about one year. I actually got my first winter box in January of this year. It's not exactly one year, but this is the first box that I got. I really like it. In almost every box, I've gotten something that I still use every day. I got a blanket and I have it on my couch. We use it every day. got a makeup mirror and I use it a few times a week. Like I said in my first video, if you haven't seen that one, I was a little hesitant on price for a long time because I wasn't sure if I wanted to pay that much for a subscription, which is around like $50 every quarter. But I think it's definitely worth it because you always get more than, like way more than you paid. And there's only been a few things that I just absolutely didn't use and I was able to resell those things. Let's go ahead and get into this box. I don't want to make this video super long, so I'm gonna try to not talk too much about each item. So I have already opened this box uh, when I got it, but here's what the inside of it looks like. As usual, you get the little like FabFitFun magazine that tells you about the products. Always have a link in the description of these unboxings for, I believe it's like $10 off your first box or something. It's not an affiliate link, but I do get, I also get $10 to put toward a box. It's a win-win for both of us if you use it. First thing is something that I chose. This is a olive oil dispenser. So obviously you use a lot of oil, olive oil when you cook. And I've never had a pretty dispenser. I've always just kept it in the bottle that it comes in. I saw this and I, I figured, I try to choose things that will be useful because I don't want to just have a bunch of stuff that I don't use. So I chose this because I knew I would use it. Here is what it looks like. It is a really pretty like ceramic bottle and it's just like a very like modern pretty shape. And then here's the top of it. Take the little lid thing off. So I still need to put olive oil in here, but I'm definitely gonna use this. This thing in the box that I chose, I saw this on there and I have been wanting one of these for so long. I never bought one because it's not a necessity, but when I saw it in this box, I knew I had to get it. This is an electric wine opener. These have been around for a while now and they're just really neat and really nice. Cause sometimes there are bottles of wine that you cannot get the cork out of and yeah, this is just gonna make it easier. So again, this is something I've already opened. Here it is, but you just like turn it on somehow and then this little thing goes down into the cork and then you push another button and it pulls it out. See, another thing I will absolutely use. So this is another thing I've wanted, but it's never something I would just buy. It is one of those electric, they're called milk, thro milk frothers and that's what they're meant for, but a lot of people use them to mix up like anything. I love Liquid IV, wish they would sponsor me, but they they won't. Cause I wish I could get a code at least, like an affiliate code literally will not give me one. Uh, I love Liquid IV and I think this would be really nice to be able to mix it up when I put it in like a glass or a cup instead of just a water bottle for coffee. Uh, pre-workout, like so many things you could use this for. The next thing in here is something that I don't remember picking if I did. This is like one of those things they have sets where you get a few small items and it's considered one item. This is a little tweezer thing with a pouch. These are definitely useful, you know, especially when I have a husband who constantly steals things like this. It's just a cute little uh, pair of tweezers and a case for them. They're very, very cute. I will definitely use this for doing my eyebrows. This thing in here, these were an add-on. So I got add-ons this time. I've never gotten add-ons because they obviously do cost money. You get a discount on the item than what it retails for, but you have to pay for the extra stuff, obviously. I got one thing that is behind me wrapped because it's my husband's like a little, just a small Christmas present that I saw on there that I know that he would like. Then these, which are blue light glasses. I've had pairs of blue light glasses before, uh, but these ones I've seen on a few people on Instagram and they're much nicer quality than what I've had. Tell the difference in quality if you compare them to my other ones. But here they are, they're just like tortoise shell. And here's what they look like on. 
really like them. I like the look of glasses, that's one thing, sometimes. Uh, but I have 20-20 vision, so I don't need glasses. <laughs> These are also, I noticed, really good because the other blue light glasses that I have, they all have a kind of orange, warm tint to them. Just a very slight one, but I'm a photographer, and so when I'm editing, if the glasses have a orange tint, it automatically makes whatever I am editing look more warm to me, so I tend to edit a little bit differently if I have is it obstructing my vision kind of or making things look, look different than they actually do. I really like these because they do not give an orange tint. They don't give a tint of anything. Next, this did come with the box. I believe I chose this. So I'm gonna take it out of the packaging. This is a really nice item to come in the box and I've seen Michael Kors items in the box before. This is a Michael Kors beanie. Super cute, very simple, and then it has the Michael Kors logo right here. I haven't decided if I want to use it. I need to try it on because I have kind of a small head, if you can't tell. I don't know if it's going to fit me. I don't know if I will wear it that much, so I'm still trying to decide on what I want to do with this. Next, this is one of the items that came with the tweezers as like a little set kind of thing. This is a liquid eyeliner by Aesthetica. We have gotten this in the FabFitFun box before. I don't know if it was last uh, winter box or if it was like the summer box or something like that. I have used this and I do like this eyeliner a lot. It's just a liquid eyeliner with a felt tip. And yeah, I really like it. This is the Time to Clear Refreshing Cleansing Gel by I'm gonna say Ahava, but I don't know if that's what it's called. So this is a facial cleanser. I honestly, um, I like skincare, but I'm really bad about keeping in a skincare routine. So I don't know. I'll probably try it, but I don't know how consistently I'll use it. Last item in the box. I think I might have chose this. I'm not sure. This is the Bryo Geo. Bryo Geo Scalp Revival Charcoal and Tea Tree Scalp Treatment, which I need. This water here in Germany, for whatever reason, my hair does not like it and it just gets dirty so quickly. And it's even like when you shower, you feel like your hair still isn't clean. I've tried so many shampoos and basically none of them change it, so I know it has to be the water here. Ooh, it's a weird color. I guess that makes sense though, because it's a bottle that it comes in. And it's kind of like a weird gray color, which makes sense for charcoal. Shake well, part the hair into sections, apply one to two drop drops to each portion of the hair, massage into scalp, don't rinse out. So you apply this after you wash your hair. Interesting. I would have thought that you applied it like right before and let it sit, but it's, it says to apply after washing hair and before styling. I will absolutely be trying this out. Let's smell it. Ooh, it smells really good. It definitely has a tea tree kind of smell. I'm definitely excited about this. I will absolutely be giving this a try and I hope it actually works because I need it. That is all that was in my FabFitFun Winter 2021 box. I really like everything I got, just about everything in here I'm going to use. So that is awesome and got my money's worth. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Thank you for being here. I love you guys so much and I truly do appreciate you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye!